What's up, YouTube? Drew from Queen City Constrictors. I uh, wanted to show y'all how I prepare my egg boxes. Um, got a video from uh, the head orange ghost female is paired with my orange ghost male. Uh, who's dropping her clutch right now. She's got one more I can see in her. Uh, so anyway, I need to pre prepare the egg box. Um, so the first thing I do is uh, obviously get this uh, bag of vermiculite. It's like 20 bucks at Lowe's or Home Depot or whatever. Um, anyway, so you know, you put this on the scale. I do a one to one uh, ratio of vermiculite to water. So obviously first we need to put in vermiculite get 250 grams let me do that real quick let's see we're at 122 I'm doing this one-handed sorry so taking, taking a little bit longer let's see almost All right, so 246. I mean, we could call that good, but for the, oh, yep. Of course, now we uh, a little bit more. I don't really want to go over. All right, 254. We'll call that good. Um, so then we'll do the. Uh, I'll take this over here. Move, dog. Very careful not to drop this while it's on the scale. Uh, then uh, we are gonna add the water. Let's see. Get a glass of water here. And I'll say an E. Sorry, I'm doing this one handed. I know this isn't the best camera work. Um, Turn that off. What the heck? We'll do this. Zero that, okay. So now, I'm just gonna take this water, pour it in. Of course it wants to spill. So we did 250 grams of vermiculite. So we're also gonna do 250 grams of water. Boom, on the dot. Go ahead and turn that off. Then, just wanna do a quick mix up. Just like that. <clears throat> so the point of what we're trying to do here with this mixture is get it so the vermiculite isn't uh, dripping wet, but also uh, so where it's going to hold the uh, the moisture pretty well. So uh, basically, let's so mix it up here a little bit more. Um, and you also want it deep enough. This is a six quart Sterilite tub, so you also want it deep enough uh, to be able to bury the eggs just a little bit. Um, and I'll show you all that when I actually put the put the eggs in. Um, she still got one more egg, like I said, so. Figured I'd make this video now to kill a little bit of time. Uh, but yeah, you want to be able to bury the eggs just a little bit. So then with vermiculite, you want to be able to grab it like this and have it clump, but not have it so it's like dripping out water. You can see that's, you know, no no water's dripping out of that. So it's, uh, it's just clumping up uh, and it's going to be just enough to hold the, the moisture without um, being too, too wet. You know, you don't want to drown the eggs. So um, anyway... Uh, some people put, uh, you know, some kind of spacer in between the eggs and vermiculite. I just put the eggs right in the vermiculite. Haven't had any issues with that. So, yeah, anyway. Then with the tub, you want to have uh, a, a hole drilled here. It's about an eighth of an inch. Um, I'm sorry, probably not even. Maybe, uh, yeah, an eighth of an inch. Um, this was a bigger hole, and I just poked something that was an eighth of an inch through a piece of... Uh, duct tape because the hole is too big before but anyway yeah so uh eighth of an inch hole give it a little bit of room to breathe do one on each side and uh yeah then your egg box is complete so uh i will be back with another video right after this of uh 
pulling the eggs out and uh thanks for watching as always check us out on facebook.com slash queen city constrictors 704 uh queencityconstrictors.com and if you have any questions or comments or concerns uh you know you can you can find my contact info on either one of those so y'all have a wonderful afternoon